In this video, I'm going to show you how to quickly find top selling e-commerce products for pretty much any niche in just a few minutes by using the brand new Wish Inspector software. Plus, you can watch right over my shoulder while I quickly show you how to import products and product reviews directly into Shopify and WooCommerce driven websites. It's going to save you so much time. So let's jump right into it. Now, if you're not familiar with Wish.com, it's basically a website similar to AliExpress.com. It's a wholesale website where you can buy products from, but you can also drop ship from this particular website, meaning that if you have an online store, e-commerce store, you can list these products on your store, and then when someone buys your product from your website, you come here and order the product, and then you enter your customer shipping address, and this company will ship the product directly to your customers which is kind of nice. It's kind of like a digital product business where you don't actually have to warehouse anything. But a lot of people actually come here as well to just research products and then you can wholesale somewhere else. This website is particularly interesting because of the fact that they actually provide you with the number of sales from each of these products on their website, which gives you a sense of how popular and how much it is selling, basically the top selling products. So if you come here to wish.com and say your niche is camping, you can come here and type in camping and then go through all these different products. But it's actually kind of difficult to sit here and look through hundreds of different images and not really pinpointing the products that you need based on this data that's more important. That's why I created Wish Inspector. Here we are inside of the Wish Inspector software and all we have to do is go ahead and type in that keyword that we want to search for, select the maximum pages and the maximum number of download threads we want to use, click search, and it will quickly get all of that data for you very, very quickly. As you can see here, we've already gone through 43, 57, it's actually downloading 15 products at the same time. With a fast internet connection, you can actually download around a thousand products in less than two minutes. So here we are, and you can see all of the amazing data that's pulled back from Wish.com, including stuff like the store rating, the store count, if it's verified or not, the keywords associated with each of those listings, the description, and all sorts of really valuable information, such as the number of orders. So now if we just sort by the number of orders, now we can see the top selling products for the keyword camping on wish.com. This is absolutely incredible and very, very powerful. And you can quickly see the price, the shipping costs, how long it's gonna take to deliver. This type of information is hard to look at when you look at through hundreds of pages on wish.com. But with Wish Inspector, it's so fast. And we've made it even faster. You can apply filters to here really, really quickly. Let's say, for example, you want to only see products that have more than a thousand orders. Just like that, we've got them. I want to look at products that have a lot of inventory so I don't lose stock. So let's say we want to look at products over 100. Boom, just like that. Now we can click the preview button and we can actually preview all of these products really quickly in a nice little sort of a grid here with all the same data and we can do all the sorting and we can even search inside of this report as well. And all we have to do is hover our mouse over top the images to see bigger versions of those images. Or you can actually just right click any row, click product description, or sorry, product details, and you can instantly see all the details of that product, including the images. And then all you do is you can click through and see the images. You can make this a lot bigger if you'd like. And then if you want to see other ones in the background, just double click any row and it will automatically load. So we've made the software really easy to use and made it really quick so you can quickly see these products and the valuable information along with these products that you really need. Next, I quickly want to show you this really cool tip on how to find great products that you could sell in your e-commerce stores. Now this may seem really oversimplified, but sometimes all you really need to do is head on over to Google and just type in something like best niches in e-commerce for 2018 or whatever year it may be. Just go ahead, type that in there and just take a look at a bunch of the websites that come up. A lot of the times it's sites like Shopify that will come in here and give you a whole bunch of suggestions of really cool products that you could try selling. And 
it comes up with some great ideas. But what I love about this is the fact that when you start searching for ideas within the software, more ideas, other different products, different things start coming up that you see that you never would have seen before. So this is just a really good place to start. So I went through and looked through a whole bunch of these different things and looked at different types of niches that could be something I'd be interested in selling and you could find so many different ideas just by searching Google and take a look at this for example these flame lamps I found a whole bunch of flame lamps that you can use and sell within your Shopify stores and if you want to quickly do some sorting within here another way of doing um, filtering I should say is you can right click and go to filters and you can load a predefined filter file that you've created for example like this and then boom it will narrow it down to the exact products you want and you can always take a look at the filters you can see all of the filters I put in here so you want orders greater than 100 inventory greater than 100 product rating better than 4.2 I wanted a product rating count of at least 300 the shipping has to ha has to be in there the uh, price is less than 20 bucks so on and so forth but you can see just how detailed you can get with your filter file but now all you have to do is go ahead and apply the filter file to your data and get exactly what you want so I did some for portable LED projectors another one for personal planners another one for herb garden even USB backpack and that was from that one Google search but I want to show you something that is even different that's really powerful let's say you didn't want to go through the headache of sort of looking through these different products and you really just don't have any idea at all of what you want to do well here's another awesome way to use the software I went over to Wikipedia and I looked for the most common words in the English language and if you go down here you'll see all the top common words the be to of and and so on and so forth you go down here you can see them split up in different uh, like nouns verbs adjectives so what I did is I went in I just put these five words into the software and I got a total of 1312 products here and you can see the search phrases as you go down the and to of and let's go ahead and apply that filter file so I'll right click filters load filter file and now it narrowed it down to 36 products. Let's go ahead and preview these products. And this will come up with a whole bunch of ideas you probably would have never dreamed of. I would have never dreamed of selling an elephant tea bag. <laughs> that is so cool. But it's a top seller on Wish.com. There's other things here like some sort of um, water teacup, leggings. It goes on and on in all these different types of niches. And it just gives you so much more ideas and now when you find something that you could use based on the numbers you want now you can go ahead and start selling these products and what's really cool this report that you're looking at right here is a self-contained HTML file which means you can actually deliver this HTML file to your clients or to your team and they can use this file just like any other file just like a PDF or like a Word document you just send them this file and as soon as they double click it from your email it just opens up in the default web browser just like any other file and the cool part is it comes with the ability to search and sort so at the very top you can actually search in real time like so as you type so it's a very powerful little report and to save that file all you have to do is click the file button and select export to interactive HTML file and save it anywhere on your computer and now you can deliver that file to your customers your clients or even your team you also have the ability to save to project file CSV and a plain text file of all that data one powerful feature we integrated into the software is the ability to import products directly into Shopify or WooCommerce let me quickly show you how to do that so what I've done here I did a quick search for hair extensions and I also used this filtering file here I got all those filters that I put in there and narrowed it down to these particular products here which is nine and I narrowed it down for about 600 so now if we go here we can now select the products that we would like to import so let's say for example I'm going to import these three options at the very top and you can see that two of these products has 16 variations now those variations could be size and color and when you're importing 16 variations in a single product on Shopify or any other 
um, e-commerce flat platform, it actually takes a long time. But all you have to do is just select those, right click and go to export and then you can create products import file. And here you select Shopify and now here you can have a few extra automation tools here which makes things so much easier. This will automatically calculate the correct prices for you when you put them into your store. For example, I want to know how much I should charge. Usually you charge 100% markup. So if the product is going to cost you say $8 or say $7 here for this particular product, you want to mark it up to $14 so you're getting 100% profit. And then you can also force the decimal point of the values of your prices, sorry, to whatever you want here. So it'll be 99. You'll see what I mean once we generate the report. Also, you can display a regular price and sale price with a with a discount. So anyhow, you have these here, you go ahead and click go and you'll save it to your computer. And just like that, it just created an import file. An import file is a comma delimited um, S, sorry, CSV file that you import directly into your Shopify store. So if I go to our Shopify store, this is a sample Shopify store that I use when I'm designing my software. It uh, sells hair weaves. So <laughs> go ahead and click the import here. And what we do is we choose that file that we just created, click import, click upload file, and now it's going to upload three products. The software also creates unique SKUs for keeping track of your inventory. And you can see that 63 images are going to be uploaded. So you go ahead and click import. And now the products are importing. It's really that simple to import all of those products and importing the variations and prices for each of those variations because one variation might be different than another. For example, different lengths of hair extensions would cost more. So you want to automatically have that done for you within the software. And there's no limitations. You can, you can actually import unlimited products into unlimited stores. So there's no limitations whatsoever in the software. And the three products here have been fully imported into the Shopify store. If you go over to the catalog section, you can see the products here and we can just take a look at that one and we can see that the prices were properly set already automatically so this is the sale price and this is the regular price you can see we got 50 percent off and we also marked it up 100 percent from the wholesale price of seven dollars in addition you can see the 99 was added to the decimal point of the actual um, both numbers of the sale price and the regular price and that was that value that we put in here. So you might want to change that to say to like 89 or 97 or 95 or something like that. It just forces those values. This comes in handy. Like I said, if you have a lot of variations, you have a product that has a lot of sizes and then a lot of different colors and each one is a different price. To manually do that takes a long time to set all those prices. This automatically sets it for you. Of course, you can go back into your Shopify store and change those prices if you'd like. And we can do a quick example for WooCommerce as well. Let's select some products here. Right click, export, select WooCommerce and create the import file. And inside WooCommerce, you go to products, select import choose file. This is the WooCommerce import file. Go ahead and click continue. Run the importer. And no time flat, the products will be fully imported into your WooCommerce store. So this makes things really easy and super fast. Go ahead and view our store. And we can see those products at the end that were implemented. This is one of them here. It was a projector. So again, you've got the title. You can see the price has been marked up 100%. This is the sale price, 50% off. That's where that little um, percentage comes into play that you see right here. You've got the size as well as the different colors. 
and all the images are automatically put in there in the description and just like with Shopify you can also import the reviews using the reviews import tool by right click export WooCommerce product reviews and we also have a video that shows you how to do this It's very simple and you can easily import reviews directly into your products as well and now that's just the tip of the iceberg there are so many cool little features we've integrated into the software that it's hard to show everything in this video but just to give you a little taste of a little bit more what we also have here is the products that you really want to keep as your favorites you can just select them right click and send them over to your favorite section here and you can have your favorites and it will automatically be saved all the time in this section and now you have a place where you can keep all your best products not only that you can also do things like searching the internet for certain products for example this first product here let's look at the product details by right clicking select product details and say we want to outsource this and see if we can try to find it somewhere else on the internet so we can just select the checkbox right click and under search we got all these different variables all these different places that we can search for so there's Google search, Bing search, Google shopping, Amazon, eBay, AliExpress, and Alibaba. So let's say for example, AliExpress. It goes right out to AliExpress and it will search for that actual title. In this particular case, it actually found some that are related right here. It looks very similar. Or we can try Google shopping. In this particular case, it actually didn't find one, but we can also just work with the title just a little bit to see if something else would come up and there it is we just found it somewhere else and now we get an idea of what kind of pricing we should do for our product another cool feature for all these products that are downloaded from wish.com it also comes with a set of keywords that the vendor includes with each product and in fact these keywords are imported into your Shopify or WooCommerce as tags which helps you with SEO and getting you uh, basically recognized in the search engines but you may want to get these keywords for something else so maybe you have a keyword um, tool or something like that you want to get these keywords to use them for your titles or descriptions or something like that well you can get them from the software very easily all you gotta do is select the products that you want with the checkboxes right click go copy and then copy selected keywords and now they're copied to your clipboard and you can right click and paste them anywhere you want just like that, you've got access to these awesome keywords. Now we wanted to make this really simple for you to get started really quickly. So we've created videos that will help you with every aspect of the software. You simply click that help button in the top right hand corner and select help videos. And you'll go over to our help section. We provide you with all types of videos and tutorials to show you exactly how to use this software and get started really quickly.